Hey, I'm Susup with the Live School team, and I'm going to show you how to easily organize your students through rosters in Live School. So, rosters are a great way to organize your students, so it's easy to view this group of students from the roster picker. And we suggest creating rosters for any group of students that you're going to see together. To view rosters, log into Live School and click on Setup. Then, choose rosters. Here, you're going to see the rosters that are going to be available to you. So feel free to peruse those as you're in there. To create a roster, click on New Roster, name the roster, whatever you're wanting it to name, and then select Create. Click Add Students and choose the grade level that your students are in. Highlight the names of each student you want to add to the roster and then click Add Students in the bottom right corner. If you have more students to add from even another grade level, feel free to do that same process uh, in the grade level that you wish to repeat the steps in. You can check which students are in the roster by clicking on the name of the roster itself. And once you've done so, you can click back. This will take you back to the list of rosters that are showing on your account. So right now, currently, the roster you just created is only going to show up in your account. And if another teacher sees this same group of students, then you can actually share that with them so they are able to access it too. Click on the share box under the roster name, and you're going to see a pop-up that comes up with the ability to click on any staff member who should have access to this roster. And notice that they are split into two tabs with some identified as teachers and others identified as being admins. And so from there, you can click the name of the staff members that you're wanting to share the roster to and just click save. The number in the share box will increase to display the total number of staff members that you're wanting to share that access to. So sometimes you might run into some rosters that maybe you're not wanting to see. And so another helpful tool is to actually hide the roster that you're not wanting to see. Click on the three dots under the name of the roster and choose Hide Roster. And you're going to see a pop-up letting you know what this means. Click Hide Roster to make sure that you're not going to see that roster in the future in the Roster Picker. If you need to unhide it in the future, just click on Show Hidden Rosters and from there you're going to see all of the rosters that you have currently hidden showing in gray. You can unhide the roster by clicking the three dots under the name of that roster and then choose Unhide Roster. This means that it will now show up in your roster picker, so then you can easily find it when awarding points and redeeming rewards. So a few things to keep in mind, if your school is syncing via Clever, you're going to automatically see rosters that are connected to you and can hide them if you're not needing them. You also can create your own rosters in Live School, and these aren't going to be synced though, so you will need to manually update the roster if new students need to be added or maybe removed. Also, if you're an admin or even a site leader, you can view all rosters by clicking all rosters and then share and hide those rosters with your teachers from there. So that's the breakdown on how to create and manage rosters in Live School. Be sure to check out our other training videos on viewing student data and getting students and staff set up with Live School accounts.